the ultimate warrior. question i miss wrestling like a few weeks hey go ahead hey, hey. <laughs> you have a short attention span i uh... <laughs> i I'm, i miss wrestling for a few weeks i thought you and hulk were close i thought you all worked together at one time and now apparently you don't like each other anymore would you like to clown <laughs> no thinking i have no disrespect for Oh, Kogan. Mm. It has nothing to do with respecting Hulk Hogan. It has to do with what the Warriors and the Hulkamaniacs have already decided. Hulk Hogan. Hulk. Hulk. has been the greatest WWF champion there has ever been. But I, the Ultimate Warrior, have not yet been. Sunday, April 1st, as my warriors hang from the ceiling of the Sky Dome and at my command, they make the sacrifice then I will begin my reign as the greatest WWF champion that ever lived! Okay. Ah, too much coffee, man. Come and sit. Um, much you are a very... Full coffee. <laughs> anger. Ah, uh, no anger. I only live to do combat with those that are the greatest. And Hulk Hogan is the greatest. Okay. Let me ask you a question. You're a very talented athlete, and you look huge next to me, but Hulk Hogan is a much larger man. How are you going to deal with him in the ring? Everything about me is larger than life. Everything I have is big. Hulk Hogan! Hulk Hogan! You must deal with the power of the word that flows through these veins! At WrestleMania 6, Hulk Hogan! Ah. I've always wanted to ask you why you wear the war paint. I Ultimate, or should I call you Ultimate or Warrior? How, how should I be? Why those that have made small sacrifices call me UW. But those that have made no sacrifices must call me the Ultimate Warrior. Okay, and where does this come from? This base place is for communication with the Warriors. As I lock eyes with a warrior that has his face painted and the outer edges of his face plate interlock with each other, then I know that that warrior is ready to make that sacrifice so that I shall live. Uh, I've really enjoyed talking to you, man. Uh, 